Hello, this is Norma and welcome to my channel. Today I'm going to be making some ribeye steak and some mushrooms. So let's start with the ribeye first. So for your um, meats, when you're ready to put it in the pan and grill it, you need to season it just before. You don't want to put salt and let it sit for a while. Today I'm going to be using some avocado oil. I have some cloves of garlic. I have some thyme, black pepper, and a rub. So the first thing I'm going to do, just put some of the rub on my ribeye. I don't like a lot of meat, so I have a little small piece. I'm going to turn that around. Some black pepper. Somebody rub again. And I'm using um, sweet and smoky the rub um, for your grill, but I'm also going to just take it and fry it on my stove. black pepper now you can follow me over to my stove my pan is hot and I'm just gonna put my ribeye steak in it and I'm gonna put some clove the garlic clove and some thyme And I want it to just fry for about three minutes and I have it hot. It's been going for three minutes and I'm going to flip it on the other side. And this time I'm going to do for a minute. I have my pan going and I'm going to put a stick of butter. And also some garlic. It's crushed garlic. That I blend it with some olive oil. And now I'm going to drop in my mushrooms. Put a little bit of black pepper. And a little bit of salt. It's been frying for two minutes. And now I'm going to add a cup of beef broth. You can also add white wine if you want. bring that to a boil. So it's back to a boil and I'm just gonna let this cook down maybe about six to seven minutes and we'll be back. It's been six minutes and my mushroom and sauce is ready. And let's start taking our food. 
So now I'm going to start with my meat. And just put my roasted garlic. And if you wanted to, you could eat some potatoes or some rice with this. I'm going to put this aside. And I'm going to put some of the mushroom sauce. And just drizzle it over my meat. set this aside and we're going to taste it and see what it tastes like. Mm. It is yummy. I hope you try my recipe. Please like, subscribe and hit that notification button so each time I upload you will be notified. Bye bye.